In this video, uh, I'm going to do some examples on uh, sequences. Okay. Now again, these questions have been taken from London Examination of IGCSE Foundation Tire. Okay, so here are five numbers, five terms of a number sequence. 1, 7, 13, 19, 25. By looking at a, when are we looking at a sequence, first is you look whether there is a common difference. So I can see there is a common difference, so you can, I can just, by looking at 1 and 7, I can say this is plus 6. So does it have the same pattern? Yeah, plus 6 is 13, plus 6 is 19, and plus 6 is 25. So write down the next term of the sequence, so the next term of the sequence would be plus 6 which is 31. So the answer is 31. Explain how you worked out the answer. So we can say I worked out the answer by just by just adding oh, by not justing <laughs> by adding <coughs> excuse me by adding 6 uh, to the previous term to the previous term previous term. Okay, or uh, there's a common difference of 6 there. So this is your first term, so you can say this is your T1, T2, T3, T4, T5. There's a formula, but I don't want to discuss the formula. So the next number, you want to write the 11th term. So you can say this is T6 is 31. Your sixth term is 31. So T7 would be plus 6, which is 37. T8 is plus 6, which is 43. So T9 would be, again, plus 6, which is 49. So can you see a pattern there? 1, 7, 3, 9, 5. So T10 would be plus 6, which is 55. And T11 is, again, the 1 is repeated. So you can see 1, 7, 3, 9, 5. Okay, and then again 1. So this is plus 6, which is 61. Okay, yeah, the, this, is, the, this is, there is a formula. The formula is like this. Tn is a plus n minus 1 times d. Where n, the question here, your a, okay, so let me explain what's the formula. A is your first term. So your first term is 1. D is the common difference. And the common difference is 6 here. Okay, so here in this case, you want to find the 11th term. So that is T11. So your N is 11. Your A is 1 plus 11 minus 1 times D, which is 6. Which is 1 plus 10 times 6 which is 1 plus 60, which is 61. You don't need to do like this. Suppose if someone is asking you what is, say, T20, okay, or T21 would be 1 plus 21 minus 1 times 6, which is 1 plus 20 times 6. This is 120, which is 121, just like that. Okay. Now, the 50th term is, so they are telling us T50 is 295. So the question is, what is your T49? So you go backwards, that is 295 minus 6, which is, you first take away 5, which is 290. So this is 289. Am I right? 289 plus 6 is, no, 290. 289. Okay, let me confirm. <laughs> 295. I should be doing this. 295. My, my brain is not working now. 289. Okay, I was right. Okay, just wanted to confirm. Okay, the question, last question is, Tasman says any two terms of, of this sequence add up to an even number. Explain why this happened. Why? Explain why Tasman, Tasman is right. Now, if you look at the sequence, all the numbers are odd. 1, 7, 9, 13, 9, all the numbers in the sequence are odd. And that's a very uh, interesting feature of odd numbers. If you take any two odd numbers, 
if they will always add to suppose let me take say any two odd numbers phi plus uh, no sorry uh, I was not right there okay so any two so year one and seven yeah so let me explain that way I'm sorry because that doesn't work for five and seven five and five plus seven is twelve okay that's even so one plus seven if you take one plus seven is oh yeah I was right there oh yeah that's what I was thinking yeah five plus seven yeah so five my brain is not working five plus seven is equal to 12 that's even I was thinking odd suppose if you take say 13 plus 13 plus uh, say 3 okay they all it is 16 so if you take any two odd numbers and you add it it will always be even okay so you can say explain the reason is any two odd numbers any two odd numbers numbers when added gives an even number gives an even number and uh, all the numbers in the sequence all the numbers in the sequence are sequence are odd you can try this is a very interesting uh, uh, result that uh, sorry all the sick all the numbers in the sequence are odd so if you add any two numbers okay any two terms of the sequence add up to an even number because of this uh, reason see you in the next